Hey guys, it's 320 Story. Welcome back to more po uh, Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. In the last episode, we took on the Ice Temple and got the second out of the three uh, s sacred medals. In this episode, we are going to be journeying around the southeast um, sector of the Great Sea and hopefully find all the treasures. First off, we got this. Special delivery! This is a letter from Aru of the Anuki. Ahem. Here's the scoop. You guy, Link. It's me, Aru, the Anuki. You really took care of me the other day. I got... I gotta say I was touched. Thank you. It got my life back. Literally. My world would have stopped if you hadn't done anything. Here's a small token of my appreciation. And he gives us a wisdom gem. Nice. And that's the end of it. Got all that? Then I'm out of here. And with him gone, let's go ahead and talk to this thing. We are currently on Harrow Island. The, um, the, uh, on uh, on this island is a mini game that where you d bring in your shovel and and you can um, dip. And for 50 rupees, you can dig up only 10 treasures. Um, after doing the ice island, or well, any time, you can uh, d you can. Uh, there's a chance that you'll find two treasure maps that don't play in this game. And we are gonna go find them. And probably some fortune. So, let's get digging. Oh, found something. A green rupee. How useful. Oh, found another thing. A red rupee. Nice keep looking around. Oh, another thing. Oh, dang. Uh, Rupor. Yeah, those things uh, are anti-rupees. Oh, found something. Found one of the treasure maps. Nice. Okay, one down, one to go. A blue rupee. That's nice. Okay, what did we get? No, not another rupee. Oh! Okay, we found both treasure maps. Nice! Let's see what else we can find. A red rupee. And what do we have here? No! Just one more treasure. And that's all the treasure we can get, so we have to go back. But, wow, I was pretty lucky to get both treasure maps in one go. And with that done, let's take off. Where to next? Our next destination is Goron Island. Okay. Oh, more mail. Special delivery. Watch out. Incoming. Now there's a letter from Gon Goron of the Gorons. Ahem. <laughs> Listen up. Gon Goron of the Gorons. Bit repetitive. My brother Goro Link. Ha How are you doing? I I've decided to work part time on a southeastern sea isle. Stop by if you're in the area, brother. I'll be. The one rolled up in a ball, making a spectacle of myself. P.S. Enjoy the gift. Oh, a courage gem. Nice. And that's the end of it. Got all that, sir? Then I'm out of here. Okay, now that that's done, there is a there's an item that we that that is available to us now that we have the. That, that now, now that we have the hook claw, or hook, let's just call it the grappling hook, or just the hook. We have an, there's a new item that is now available to us now that we have the hook. So let's make our way right over here and grapple onto this rock. And right here will be a treasure chest. And inside a courage gem. Just getting the gems, uh, just getting gems galore, guys. Oh, more mail. 
Wow, I'm a popular guy today. There's a letter from jo Joanne the Mermaid. Ahem. This should be saucy. <laughs> Thanks for delivering that letter for me. It was so nice to hear from my sister. I haven't run into Jolene yet, but that's okay. It's just good to know that my sister's got always got that connection. Blah, blah, blah. We're just obsessed with dressing and costumes. My sister prefers the, her silk pirate clothes to, to her mermaid cons, constant. What? Blah, blah, blah. What else? Oh, she gave us a meager cannon. Wow. Gee, thanks, Joanne. All right, that done. Let's see what's next. Ah, next up is the it is the other is the next up is to go meet with Gongoron, who mentioned a who mentioned watching him put on a show. Let's see what he mean means by that. We are heading to You know what? Let's see. Oh, crap. Let's use this. Bye bye, Jolene. Dang, was she waiting for me? I think she was waiting for me there. But anyways, our destination is that oddly familiar shaped island. Oh great, these things. Oh, they're gone. Huh. All right, let's see what we got here. Last we checked this island, the game was closed, but now it seems to be open. Welcome to the game that's all the rage. Yes, it it's the Gor Goron game. Would you like you want to take it for a spin? 50 rubies, brother. Sure. Let me explain the rules of the Goron game. There are several targets scattered about the course, brother. Break all of them and the final path and, and the final path to the finish line will open. Think efficiently and quick Think quickly, and most of all, think like a Goron and win. Think you could do all that? Now I'll introduce you to your daring sidekick in the Goron game. He'll be the one actually rolling around the course for you. Go for it, Gon Goron. Yeah, brother. I am the one and only star on this island. My fans call me Gon Goron. What? Hold on. What are you doing here, Goro Link? We were wondering the same thing. I got a part-time job to help my dad me make ends meet. Isn't he the chief? How does he have to make ends meet if he's the chief? But we'll be unstoppable with you rolling me around, Link. The best time so far has been 35 seconds. Well then, let's get going. Ah, darn it. Okay, I'm definitely not breaking any records. <laughs> Consolation prize, what do we get? Okay, we didn't get get what we were wanting, but I'll be right back and and, and I'll be right back, guys. Um, what, so, so I can show you what you get if you do beat the record.
Okay, I did it. Second try, too. Nice work, Gongoron. Time is 31 seconds and 90 milliseconds. A thrilling record, and you just went, made the new high. <laughs> Take the thrilling prize. And we get a bomb chew bag. Now we can ch carry more bomb chews. Want to try for a new record? Uh, no, I don't. But thanks for thanks for the offer anyway. Whew! I'm actually surprised I got that on my second try. Live and learn, I guess. And with that done, let's head on out. Th that is our last destination in the southeast sector. So let's head to the other sector. The southwest sector. Okay, he right here on the island of Ember, there is a treasure that we were unable to get uh, up until now. Use your grappling hook to grapple onto this chest, and then... Another courage gem. They're just handing these out now, aren't they? Let's grapple back, and I believe our next destination is Molita Island. The island that's far to the e west of this sector. You know where Melita Island is. I'll see you guys there. Okay, now that we're here on Melita Island, our first stop on this island is it is the cave where we fa where we uh, found well this cave. It, I forget what it's called. I'll just call it Melita Cave. Avoid these guys. Whoa! Ow! Get out of my way. Just jump across. Link. Jump across these. And before you jump across the last one, uh, use your grappling hook to jump up to get to this chest and power gem. Nice. How many, how many power gems does that make? 15? Nice. Alright, let's see what's next. Guess just lo loop around. Up. Oh. Do I really need to deal with you again? So stay back, and I'm gonna leave you. Out of my way, you Octoroc. It's kind of weird. You never guess those things are Octoroks. Okay, how do I get up there? I'm kind of lost. Ah, there we are. Alright, let's see. Head around this way. And there should be a grapple point. Okay. Don't do that. Can I grapple a tree? Okay, how do I do this? Hmm. How do I do this? What if I smash the barrel? Oh! Hello! Are you kidding me? Where are you, stupid cuckoo? There you are. Okay, now what? I'm stuck. Okay, maybe not. Hang on, guys. Okay, that's how you do it. Alright, once you're up here, dig that this spot, and you get a treasure map. And it's in another spot that we can't reach. Yet. 
Sucks for you, chicken. I'm out of here. Okay, is there anything else? Huh. The next item is at the Temple of Courage. Huh, maybe I should have gone that first. Shoot. Oh well. Just gotta equip this. You ain't getting me that time. Alright, go on up. Hmm, nice. Ah, son of a. Whoa, go on, run. No, ow. Okay, I believe this is it right here. There's a pull right here. Tra chest. Courage gem. Alright, how many gems does that make? Let's see, 14, 15, 15. Nice. Now let's finally head back. Okay, stay away, stay away. Huh, I was not even tr trying to attack them. Our next stop. I believe is Spirit Island. I'll see you guys over there. As you can see right up there, you can actually see the chest that we're going to get um, right up there on the ledge. It's kind of a neat little detail they added. Okay, we've arrived at Spirit Island. As you can probably see, there is a whole area that we have not explored yet. But now that we have the grappling hook, we can explore this area. Watch out for these Octoroks that are just con continuously firing their arsenal. Okay, now with those things dead. Oh, I did not mean to do that. Okay, we got a like like down. Whoa! That is a new enemy. These are rupee like likes. They will. As the name implies, they will steal your rupees. So let's just toss a couple bombs down there. Oh! <laughs> D triple threat. Okay, let's push this out of the way. No, you don't. No, 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 no. Ah! Okay, I didn't lose my shield. No, you don't. No, you don't. Stay back. Okay. Now that those annoyances are out of the way, open this chest and power gem. And our business is conclu is concluded here. Huh, I could just type rope along. With. All right, next stop is Banana Island or the Wafer Island, as I've taken to calling it. You know where it is. I'll meet you there.
Alright, here we are at Banana Island. There are quite a few stuff for us to get. Um, first, namely, uh, let's look around here. Let's kill these enemies first. This place is infested, I swear. Okay, let's see what's first. First up, let's dig around this place. Map right there. Again, treasure maps galore. I'll be sure to show what uh, items we get. Secondly, there is a chest right over here. Open it up. Power gem. I tell you, they're just handing out these power gem, these gems like they're candy. Anyways, next place, right over, right, right up where you did the cannon mini game. Just gotta use your grappling hook. Oh, oh crap. Oh, courage gem. Wonder what's in the other chest. Oh, big green ruby, nice. And finally, there is a, there's another chest right over there and to get to it, gotta do this. Made it, what do we have here? Look at the stone tablet on the left. Look at the stone tablet to the side. Okay, this is the one I have not read yet. Look at the stone tablet on the right. If you look closely, something is scribbled in very small letters. I bury something between nice between the two chests. Okay, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, what do we have that's buried but between the chests? Another treasure chest. Nice. Gonna be getting a lot of treasure that ne next uh, off screen. Okay, now that we've done that, our f we have one last stop to make, and our last stop is the Uncharted Island. Remember that place? It's where we got the Cyclone Slate. I'll meet you guys over there. All right, we've arrived at the poorly drawn Uncharted Island. Our uh, item of interest is right here in the cave. As you can see, there are, uh, there are stakes right here. Just got to make a connecting line and walk across. Let's see what's in chest number one. Another courage gem. Guess it takes some courage to walk across a rope. Anything over here? No, there isn't. Is that all that there is here? Yes, there is. All that's left is to do all the is to collect all the treasure map, the, all the second treasures. But I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode right here. I'll do the I'll uh, ship show on screen what each of the treasures are at, after I end the episode. Next time on Legend of Zelda: Phantom Hourglass, we're gonna return to the Temple of the Ocean King and hopefully find the final sea chart. See you guys later.